Bristol, the offices of consulting structural engineers Fenton Holloway, charged with making Britain's greatest warship safe for her next 100 years and beyond. Uh, there were known defects with the ship. In 1922, the ship was raised in its dry dock condition. Um, doing that uh, required the installation of 22 steel cradles. The ship now bellies, its hull bellies between those cradles. We had the ship laser scanned. Um, we had that laser scan turned into the many different components and elements that make up the ship. And from that, we were then able to create a computer model. In addition to that, we needed to understand what materials the ship was made from, um, what section sizes were used in the frames, in the planks, in the posts and in the beams. In fact, we found it was well within its strength capacity, which led us to ask another question. Well, if it's being so lightly stressed in its current condition, um, why is it bellying so much between the cradles and we came to the conclusion that the ship um, was creeping um, under its own self weight so that sagging and creep between the cradles was having a detrimental effect on the rest of the ship. A new support system was clearly essential but how and where should it be placed to stop the sagging? Within the hull there are some very large timbers called riders um, and they're enormously stiff. They carry a lot of the ship load. So it became apparent that our placing props directly under those riders would be picking up a lot of the load. So the solution that we've come up with allows for us to support the ship with 136 props in two lines um, and four transom props at the stern. Each prop um, has a load cell within it um, which gives real-time feedback. So over the long term, we'll be able to establish if any parts of the ship are beginning to deteriorate. So that money isn't wasted doing wholesale repairs, but it can be focused on areas of the ship that really need it. We believe that we've come up with what are the right answers to help the ship remain in a sound condition for a long time to come. It's a great source of pride.